Welcome to Ask the Attorney. I'm Natasha Lubchenko. We're answering your toughest personal injury questions and joining us today with expert advice is attorney Chris Murray from the Heyman Law Firm. Chris, it's great to see you. Our viewer Aaron could use your advice today. Here's his question. I was in a motorcycle accident that wasn't my fault and I broke my ankle. My doctor said I'll be out of work for at least three to four months. I'm a self-employed home improvement contractor and this is my busy season. I'm making a personal injury claim against the person who hit me. Can I make a claim for lost wages even if I'm self-employed. What do you think here, Chris? Uh, great to be back, Natasha. Absolutely. Now, in any personal injury case, there's two components. Non-economic damages, which are your pain and suffering, your bodily injuries, and your economic damages, which are your medical bills and your lost wages. Now, when someone is out of work, typically they work for a company. They're not self-employed. And it's pretty easy to establish their loss. We write to the uh, personnel department, and we get their payroll records, which establish not only the rate of pay, but the, the time that they were out of work. When they're self-employed, it's a little bit more tricky because we need that documentation. So what we do is we ask our clients to get their tax returns for the two to three year period before their accident. That will establish their rate of pay. And then we ask for their tax returns for the year of the accident, and that will establish the loss. So to answer your question, yes, you can make a claim for lost wages if you're self-employed but you need the documentation to do that. All right, so can be a tricky situation, but there are ways around it. Uh, Chris Murray, great insight as always. Thank you. And if you have personal injury questions of your own, email them to asktheattorney at heymandlaw.com. You can also call 1-800-HEYMAND. For now, I'm Natasha Lubchenko, and we'll see you next week.